of Malaysia as well, which is pretty interesting, right? Uh, Trimbles and I were just talking about the CC, how it can bring value in terms of its flanks, and suddenly, like, you know, it can shred through the likes of the high loss. That's it! Oh, but neither are we seeing support to his side of the map. And right off the start, we do have Sensui just going to be opening things up on the cram with a spear of the Alpha, but that doesn't seem like that's going to be the over just yet. Sakai did get caught for a little bit, but Yum joins into the battle and pushes Iris back a bit. Ooh, in the meantime, we see the 1v1 win. Innocent got dived under the tower. Previously has affected them a little bit. They got the turtle, that's fine. They still got to do better though. Grace just going to be getting himself a good amount of crowd control onto you, but you is just going to be fighting right back. Kicks him right into the face of Sakai's. And such, that is going to be yet another point. Use a scouting so that they can control the turtle area a little bit better. Red Esports has the slight net worth lead, and they have no more players around for now. With the glorious pathway puffing themselves right into the side of him, but it doesn't seem like things are going to be working all that great as well. But unfortunately, with the Frigid Glacier, it connects down on the sensory and bottom side to the mid lane mm -hmm. and such yums takes a quick flicker mm -hmm. only to be wasted as he is being very aware of what yums is trying to do he had a very good cancel unable to find the trade straight away but now the dive on top side uh, and iris he still wants to be uh, on a hyper aggressive sakai joins in but didn't really quite land the stun down on the iris with the purify the rest of the members from the side of red esports jumps in but hypsalango red giants they are safe right underneath their turret mm -hmm. stop out you think that was like overly forced because this is starting to look bad! Stormy. Stormy, why are you still here? I feel like they're getting like a little cocky here. They're kind of allow- Oh! oh, oh. Sakai's caught with his pants down! When it comes down to the diversion, even feeling here. You can see already confident enough to start invading the purple buff too. Glorious pathway popped right up. Sensui immediately jumps backwards with the Spear of Alpha. Well, Yum's HP doesn't seem to be all that great does. Owl Ooh. just wants to jump right into the face of Yum's, but didn't really quite manage to connect the last hit. Well, Grace goes in of Shatter with a flicker, but he's gonna be caught and taken down by the hands of Stormy. The rest of Red Esports will want to take a run for it. Mm. In net, because SRG already knows they've been punished for being overconfident this tournament. And the Spear Dragon connected down the cramps definitely will be shredding him down like a hot knife through butter. And this is getting pretty brutal here. Oh, the kick. And with a dragon connecting down, doesn't seem like Grace will be able to get himself out of that. But that was just a collateral damage all the way through. As Yooms is going to be the one that's taken down. Whoa. Sakai's hopes that he will be able to get his kill down on the Sensui, leaving him at just a oh. slow. But Sakai turns it around, gets himself a kill onto Owl. Just a little bit more before he will be able to turn things around. But Iris, he still managed to connect all the yo-yos right into his face. And Stormy takes the fall. He is going to chase you down forever. Oh, hold on. Whale Dragon connecting down on the Iris, but it does seem like he will not be able to get away as Innocent takes up that one kill. Innocent, though, it does seem like he's not going to be anywhere uh, at all with the quick little confidence as they make these plays is all. Oh. Oh, Loris pathway plus the roam, but it doesn't seem like things are going to work too well. Yooms gets a kick on the Grace, but it is going to be split into two fights. As such, Yooms has got no follow up, and such is going to be taken down by both Owl as separation here, where they know as long as they do their thing, they come out on top. Owl will catch us too, and it doesn't seem like things are just going to be working too great for them. As Grace is going to be taken down, since it's going to be nicked on the chopping block. Iris went too far, as such, that is going to be an easy triple. For he doesn't mind looking for countering engages when he has Winter Crown active. Dooms, as well as Cram, tries to open things up as much as possible uh -huh. just to find where Red Esports is. Uh -huh. But it is definitely a pandemonium in the front lines. But Sekai still manages to connect down onto the Lord, takes one for him. The Pride of Life pops from the side of Stormy, but still completely obliterated from the side of Owl. Red Esports now have got Solango Red Giants running back. Uh, honestly, I think that Red e Oh, hold on. Oh, oh wait, what was Yooms? that? Yooms! The Flicker, not the way to start things off! As such, he's gonna burn the immortality. At least when it comes down to Shupo, he'll still be able to get away. The rest of Red Esports, they would really want to keep up chase, but we do have the diversion from Sonic Camp. It connects down on the Yum and Graham! Stormy from the side, hoping that the Frigid Glacier will be able to turn the tides around, as such it allows the guys to at least pick one off of the Owl, as such Ooh. this might be what they want to do, and they will want to run it down in the middle lane, taking him down! Start things off, might work out a little better. 
the Lord coming down to half HP. Jooms wants to look for something, but he did manage to connect down onto Grace. But it does seem like the immortality is just going to be popped. And Sakai takes the Lord down. Sakai continues onwards, and that is going to be a good amount of members from the side of Radiant Spots taken down. Sends to his next one onto the guillotine. Oh, oh my oh. Innocent catches up, but he pops Ow. all the immortality. I will look at a fraction of HP. Immo Im immortality immediately bought. So even if Sakai didn't manage to catch up with the Cyclone's eye, doesn't seem like they will be able to follow it up. No! Found himself in the pixel burst. Oh my guys! He managed to find the arrow and lands right down on the owl. Oh. That's gonna be great as the Senegal Ray Giant marches through mid. They found the opening after 18 minutes. SRG will turn around the early game lead and claim victory in game number one. Thank God. If you want to try and pull away from us, we're going to figure out a way to get even deeper into enemy lines with the Claude. I am not personally a big means of escape unless and so he drops the alt. But I don't think Grace is too... Uh, hold on. Oh, Deadly Catch all the way up to the top lane. Innocent hopes to run away, but he decides to run right in the face of oh! No! That's a toy, and that worked out! You want to run back, right? But he's like, oh, oh, let me face the enemy! But speaking of facing the enemy, Innocent, what are you doing? Why are you still in the lane? As he helps things out, and he managed to get a drop. He's got the tier one. And now all five members from the side of SRG marches himself over to the turtle side and it does seem like Split Split connects down in the grace and managed to yoink him out of commission. Gets a tier one. What is the rest of the team doing? Like, why are we even bothering the contestants? You just need to protect them from the dive. I agree with you. No reason for them to contest the turtle when their jungler is literally doing something. Hey, yo, whoa, whoa. Iris is just taking the entire world all by himself. He wants to walk the glue underneath the oh, turret, wow, but he continues up with the Inferno Pursuit. Stormy trying to TP. Where is he TPing to? Oh, uh -oh. oh Sensui! What? Surprise! How? Right in there at the perfect time. How did they know he was there? And on the opposite side of the map. And speaking of which, Graze, surprisingly, he, also, he still survived all of that. In an absolute monster on this glue. This glue is just hands down annoying as we have talked about time and time again. The Infernal Pursuit can only get him so far, but Red Esports seems to kind of want to continue with this. Grace immediately vengeance for- No, the turtle's coming. Wait, Stormy's opening up the map on towards the purple side. <gasps> Doesn't seem like things are going to be working. Oh, okay, oh! Deadly Catch and everything else is going to be puckering out for us. Owl gets onto his motorbike and he's going to be A-OK -okay, at least for now. The rest of the members from the side of Ready Sports, there's no one down just yet, but Sensui takes the fall. It the Tamus, the CC, he makes things happen. Oh, oh they, Sensui. Can he get out? Check Not in. again! Oh, no! <laughs> It's Here's Johnny as the Raz of Salango Red Giants knocks under the door of Sensui, bringing him down once again on his split leader because he's just leaving stuff on the floor everywhere. <laughs> 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 we're gonna find him, man. At this point, we're gonna find him. Well, the fight is gone going here. They're rushing straight in. And immediately, Innocent manages to find one. And does we have, do we have more of this? Ready, Spots? Three. Going back out again, kind of the reason why we kind of banned chewing gums in the first place. Oh, 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 oh hold on. And not done. Sensui gonna be taken down once again as now Graham oh. makes his debut right in the face of Grace. Take, taking two person off from the side of Red Esports while the Lord is preparing to plunder right down the middle lane. It kind of looks like SRG has kind of found their footing. They've got their momentum again back to regular season form. And now the rest of the Salango Red Giants knocks onto the door on the side of Red, uh, Sol uh, Red Esports. Spots. And now the Inferno Pursuit from the side of Iris hopes that he will be able to keep people alive. But now it's just going to be left with Kim. What can he possibly do? As the Lego Red Giant knocks on the core and shattered it to the core. This is what we've been waiting for, isn't it, Gideon? This is the Salango Red Giants. At Esports, this is going to be a really important matchup here. Cram got rolled the last time in this Hylos versus CC, but still needs to provide utility. And Though they are dealing with a Suyo, this hero handles that very well. Oh, oh no. Oh. Owl. Owl. He, still ha he still have Flicker though, but... Uh, He's dead. He, he, he went for the Flicker, but... He didn't see the tactical roll? I... I don't oh. know. I don't know about that one, but things are not going very well right now for... But Yume's already sees it. 
is going to release you at level 3 though. Don't have the implosion just yet. But the rest of the members from the side of Red Esports, especially Grace, is taking quite a beating. And now Stormy actually did manage to take away the Primal Wrath and wanted to do something onto Kim. But that Ooh. is going to be a blink of Shadow that's going to be connecting. But unfortunately, not quite enough to save Kim as well as himself as he sacrificed himself to make oh, sure explosion. that Red Esports will oh, be able what? to do a little bit more. No. Look at the help of the U.S. No as the way. guys, as Sensui was hoping that he will be able to close up. Absolute best to keep him away, but now this next fight, it's not going to be easy against Stormy. Oh, yep. Iris, he kind of went all the way in, but at least he does have vengeance. Oh, no! That's what no! you want to see! The big implosion, imploding right down on Red Esports. Just has to try and distract them with his yo-yo tricks. Otherwise, there's no real way of going in because we can see that they're playing around Grace so well. Look at how they sidestep it. As we have the uh, glorious pathway, Cram was hoping that he would kind of push the oh. back. Backwards, but oh, Stormy finds a kill down on the grave. Oh. The spell of Alpha wasn't able to do quite much. Essentially, finds himself in the heat of the battle. As Alpha gets himself won, but at a sacrifice of himself. And now, Kim getting a good amount of damage. Oh. for one another. As Sakai's and one for all. And defense would have dropped down anyways. But there's the Ooh. Oh. Grace start things out with the uh, of Shadow. Oh. For Stormy, he didn't manage to get himself away with just that a little bit. But unfortunately, the yo yo tricks as well as the tanglement just make sure that Stormy. Hey, wait, hold a second. The Demon Smash is not quite enough to bring Stormy out just quite yet. It's now Red Esports. They made sure that they will be where each other are. But Cram is starting the scout. You really want to get himself in the face of Iris. Sakai still continues to take the Lord away from himself. Sensu he definitely tried, but right now he's within a lock pit and it doesn't seem like he will be able to get out at all. As now the rest of the members for the Southern Raid Esports, they want to tuck their tail and run away by our flick. Oh! Only to be punished by Sakai! As that is offensive footwork once again. Sakai found one, and now the rest of the members from the side of Red Esports, they are just unable to turn things around. Iris pops a vengeance at that low oh, amount of hit. Oh, nice. And the arrow seals the deal for Sakai. Oh, with that being said, you know it's going to happen. They don't even need the Lord. GG, well played for the Salango Red Giants as they move on in the lower brackets, knocking out Red Esports. This